Hi, my name is Seren Leon. In this video, I want to show you the daily life of cordyceps harvesters. It was part of my field work in Shangri-La, a Tibetan region in China. I did this field work in summer 2018 for my master thesis at Heidelberg University, Germany. Cordyceps is a parasitic fungus which kills a caterpillar and grows out of it. The caterpillar fungus complex is usually used as a tonic for general strengthening. It is quite expensive. For example, it is sold for 50,000 US dollar per kilogram in Shanghai. The caterpillar fungus only grows at high altitudes, 3,000 meters above sea level at least. That's why I'm taking this two-hour motorbike ride from the nearest village called Gunfuitsun. It was all the way up, we had to cross a snow mountain to reach the seasonal camp, where Cordyceps harvesters live during the harvesting season. As you can see, the road was quite bumpy, and our motorbike slipped and fell once. Every morning I was woken up by these Tibetan pigs asking for breakfast. My host Roma fed them with warm turnip soup. After our breakfast, we were ready to go to the high mountains to look for the caterpillar fungi. I didn't expect that the way to the high mountains would be so hard. Soon after setting off, I was embarrassed by how slowly I walked. A 62 years old grandma walked faster than me. After a two hours hike, harvesters spread it out to look for the caterpillar fungus. The searching requires patience, concentration and a certain fitness. By the way, throughout my research, I myself didn't spot any caterpillar fungus. Maybe that's why they let me follow them, because they knew already I'm not a competitor. Only after several hours searching, a harvester found one caterpillar fungus. Okay, now I pause here for a second. Can you try to see where the caterpillar fungus is? Here you go! Apart from searching for caterpillar fungi, harvesters also have to milk tso, a hybrid of yak and cow. They usually roam around freely. But they come and wait outside of their owner's hut to get milked around 5 o'clock in the afternoon, because tso would get a bucket of tasty barley flour in return for their milk. Thanks for watching. This was some part of my field work. I hope you didn't fall asleep in veterans, and I hope you enjoyed the video.